All right, hello everybody. Happy Monday, and welcome to um. I'm just gonna ignore that. Uh, Origami King of the Paper Mario. Yes, gonna play more of this. I'm actually probably gonna be playing a lot of this this week because I just really want to make some good progress in it. I think tonight I want to, at the very least, um, defeat the next Velemental. Uh, even though we're not even like in the next area yet, because we have this little uh, side thing of the Princess Peach ship. But hopefully that won't take too much longer. We can head over to where the yellow streamer is going to be and uh, take down our next elemental. So I'm just going to clean my glasses here real quick. All right. So I can actually kind of see. Okay. It's a lot better. Yep. Back to the Princess Peach. To see what secrets lie within. It's kind of a spooky ship. I don't really know exactly what's going on here. But Bobby seems to know something, so... We just gotta keep going with uh, whatever he wants, I guess. Oh, can we open this? Yes. We can. Have I fought any folded bob bombs? I'm not even sure. I don't think so. Okay, wait. Was there really no point of coming over here then other than for that dialogue? I guess not. Okay. Well. Uh. Let's see. Maybe over here? No. Yeah, just go in here. Flashy hammer. Uh, hang on. I want to click that. Uh, switch out the shiny hammer for the. It's a flashy hammer, right? Yeah. Okay. So I am in. The like crew room. Engine room is in the ship's hold, which is going to be below us. There's a ladder to our right. However, oh, I didn't even get to hammer him. Okay, fine, I guess. better. Alright, um, Shy Guys I should only really need a normal hammer for. Uh, yeah, especially since I hit the excellent. You know, you guys I probably need shiny boots for. Nope, that actually did not kill them still. And... My shiny boots broke. Oh, at least one of them died. Oh, well, they failed. But, yeah, back up. That's always fun. Should 
suffice. Same here since they're all pretty weak. Alright, trying to see if I uh, <laughs> have any more shiny boots, because. Yeah, mine broke. Yes, I do. Okay, good. Um, wheelhouse. Eh, probably just need to go up there after we go down the ladder. So we'll investigate here first. Now this room has definitely seen better days. Here, have some Sakura pedals to, you know, repair your ship. That's how that works. Such a weird, like, vanity item to just turn your confetti into Sakura pedals, but I mean, I like it, so I'm gonna keep using it. this would kill them or not. Yeah, so if I want to get them in one go, shiny iron boots. It's just, you know, it's kind of better to save that for when I actually have to use them on spiky enemies. There are a lot of you falling from the ceiling. like underneath my foot. I didn't know if it was like a rock or like a pebble or something, but whatever. It's fine. Okay. What are we doing here? Uh, we are moving you. Probably need to use something more than a normal hammer on the other dudes. Especially if I don't get a excellent Got him. Because I managed to get an excellent. I'm sort of getting better at that. Okay, what are they scared of exactly? I don't know if I should be worried or not. Something definitely is. Uh. <laughs> causing all the spookiness here. Yeah, that's probably a good thing to do if the game's gonna leave that there for me. Yeah, no. Just checking. Thought maybe I'd be able to jump. Okay, what do we got here? Oh. Spiders. I don't remember what these things are called. Mm, I don't like how they walk, though. Oh, there are a lot of them. Okay. I get three moves here. Easy. 
Scuttlebug. <laughs> oh, Scuttlebug. Okay. Um, I guess I'll try normal boots. It might be enough. <clears throat> okay, no. Normal. There's not enough at this point. So I'm going to go ahead and use a shiny hammer on the other dudes. got one, Bobby. I'll take it. Sneaky. Going for the back attack. Normal boots should be fine now since I weakened them, but well, at least I now know that at the start it's not going to be enough for these guys. So I have a lot of toads in the uh, audience now. Hammer's already almost broken. Okay, well, <laughs> never mind about almost. Uh, I'll just use these because they might break after it. Whatever. Oh, no, they didn't break. Sweet. Spiders defeated. Get out of here. Now then. Let us repair the uh, machinery. Insert the starting lever, turning like there's no tomorrow. I don't think we have the starting lever, though. Yeah. No, we don't. Alright, well, time to find that, then. I noticed that. Perhaps this toad may know something. Okay, mm maybe you don't know. You know anything about a lever, sir? Sure, it's fun to scream crisis. It's on the switch now, which is kind of cool. I guess. How do I get to that? Okay, here we go. I mean, it actually is pretty cool that a game like Crisis is on the Switch. Uh, but, yeah. Okay, so I guess the lever isn't going to be here. Maybe I do have to go up to the wheel room. Alright, I'll play your game game. lever? I mean, I don't... <sighs> nope. I'm not here. You see nothing. Yeah, I guess I'll just go and see if it's in the uh, the wheel room. Maybe we can take the steering wheel <coughs> uh, for the ship and just use that. Oh. He stepped on a toad. I think. No, but I can't just walk on him, so... Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, let me check this room. That's a lot of peach uh, memorabilia. Oh. Did you eat my friend? Yeah, you did. Okay. <laughs> How rude. Oh, and they still have him. Oh, okay. Never mind. We're good. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Have we? No, I think we have fought one of these dudes before in the um, like autumn-looking area. Still, I don't remember if... Oh, that's right. My shiny hammer broke. 
Eh, I guess we'll bust out the flashy hammer. I forgot to equip another one. <laughs> yeah, no, they're definitely dying to that. And one more shy, guys, so... Old reliable boots should do the trick here. Alright, try not to get eaten anymore, Bobby. Oh, cool. Yeah, I have a few ideas of what I'm going to use it for. Crew member priorities, safety, hospitality, customer satisfaction. Hey, a superstar. And then, can we do anything here? I mean, probably not. The ship doesn't have power, so, yeah. Okay, well, we got our lever. I guess let's just check this other room. And if there's anything else up here. No, nope, just another room. Okay, never mind. Yep. Okay, well, we got our lever. And now we can hopefully... Oh, well, I guess we're doing this so we can use the elevator. Not really sure if there is a purpose or if we even can like control the ship once the power is on from the uh, wheel room. Be interesting, but I'm not holding my breath. Okay, lever time. And now, what? Just hit it with my hammer? Yeah. Problem solver. Wooden hammer. Oh, well, the lights are very nice in here. <laughs> was I funny when I had amnesia? Also, before I forget, hammer. Uh, if I have another one, that is. Yes, I do. Good. Might need to stop by the weapons store soon. Because I'm going through these weapons a lot faster than I... Oh. Hmm. Yeah, that's probably bad. <clears throat> I don't think the ship is moving, right? Since no one's controlling. Huh... Okay. Black goop. Oh god, we move slower. And even the enemy is covered in it. So... It's like a... Squid, right, or blooper, I guess. Yeah. <clears throat> Wait, is it gooper blooper? Because that's the only big one that I can think of. Like from Super Mario Sunshine. That'd be really cool if it was. I mean, they used Birdo earlier, so it seems like they're definitely... Wait, no, no, we don't want to be here. So it seems like they might be more open to the idea of using older Mario characters, so I'm down if it's Gooper Booper, because, yeah. Uh, it's been a while since I played Mario Sunshine, but he was a relatively reoccurring boss in that game. I think he fought him, like, three times. Uh, let's see, I think the elevator was in here. Oh god, it's very, it's very inked in here. Hold on, before we go in there, I kind of want this. Shine iron boots. Got all of the question mark blocks here. Okay. Another Dark Souls door. Fun. Is there anything over here? Well, yeah. An inked toad. Oh, get off that door, sir. No bugs allowed. Two moves. Okay.
buy time. Because, okay, two moves. Power through it, even without the damage buffs. Although that's probably gonna break my boots. And also, I didn't even kill all of them, only one of them. Well, okay. Yeah, those damage buffs are pretty important. Oh well, it's fine, I got plenty of health. Come at me. back. This is uh, not going very well. I don't know why I didn't just buy more time. Because now I've got to take more damage. Okay, well, at least he got one. Okay. Oh, actually, these guys aren't weak. I don't think this is going to kill them. Oh, we're good. I guess the, the buff helped me there. Now watch, this door's just not even going to open now. Okay, well, surprise it did. Oh, oh, okay. That's that door. Got a shortcut. Well, let's see what going on in here since Bob B really wants us to be in here for whatever reason. Ooh. I'll take that. Alright, before I open the box, are there any, any secrets to be revealed in here? No? Okay, fine. Box it is. Why is he entering the code? He doesn't have fingers. Hmm. Okay, well, yeah. That's kind of a problem. Wait, does this flower just go back? Yeah, they kind of did. It's interesting. Can I just jump out the window? No. Okay, fine. I'll use the stairs. There's only one window I'm allowed to jump out of, I guess, and it's the one downstairs, which leads to the, uh, deck. Yeah, he's still not waking up. Alright, okay, let's save, because... Probably about to have to have a, a boss fight. Hey, it is Gooper Blooper. Awesome. Or like a paper mache Gooper Blooper. Cool. 
cool. I, it's like I said, it's oh whoa. Oh right, right. This is a paper mache one, so we're doing this in real time. Cool. But yeah, it's man. Yeah, I, I don't think they've used him in a game since uh, crap since Sunshine. At least not that I remember. So that's pretty cool. I like how they're bringing back some older characters for uh, like this game. But I guess Super Mario games have always been kind of more open to using uh, older like characters or characters aren't really used anymore. Because like ninjas, they're still used quite a lot in Super Mario games, even though they're not really used in the platforming games anymore. That's going to be annoying. It's a coin skip, though. Oh, God. No. Oh, got rid of all his tentacles. Which is also kind of something similar in Sunshine, because I think I remember you like had to rip them off of him, which was kind of brutal, honestly. But yeah, that was how you like defeated him in Sunshine. Here, let me hit you in the eye, or not? Yeah. Okay. Now I can. now, right? Oh, I guess I... Yeah, I need to wait until he's dizzy. Monk. Are you dead? Nope, not yet. Rule of threes doesn't apply here, surprisingly. Despite this being a Mario boss. Okay, wait. Oh, no. So not dead. Oh. Although he, uh. He's not looking too good, so I'm thinking one more hit, and that's it. Nice seeing you again, Gooper Blooper. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> I ate all the toads. <clears throat> Welcome back, everybody. What is it, though? I don't know what it was. side quest is complete. <clears throat> Just get all this confetti even though I don't need it. Anything else to say, Captain? Okay. Well, uh, hopefully that toad who brought us here is still here. I don't really see why he wouldn't... Oh, actually? Wait. I wonder if that other door is open now. Uh, probably don't think about it too much. But yeah, there is another door. I wonder if it's open now. Or if we'll just have to come back later. Oh, the ink is still here. Nope, okay. I guess we'll just have to come back later. Alright then.
a collectible. So I wonder if Bobby just had been on this before, or if he was like an employee or something. I don't know. Well, I guess... I don't know if he'd be an employee. He's kind of one of... He's a bob on so... I don't know if Peach would want to employ Bowser's minions. We need to rescue the passengers at abandoned ship, but there's too much fog. Alright. So I'm probably coming back here later then. Shall we ship out? Yes. We must head back to the canyon to save our origami friend. Yeah, just return to town. I don't think there's really much a uh, need for us to explore the ocean right now. Okay, now, uh... I guess I'll stop by the weapons shop while I'm here. But I also have to remember if there was a... Was there a fast travel, like, pipe? I mean, there had to have been, right? I got back here pretty quick to go to the Princess Peach, so... Okay, what do I need? Probably some more shiny boots. And definitely some more shiny hammers. Get like three. I don't think there's a like a limit how many I can hold, right? Just how many I can equip, which I think is four of each. Yeah, let's get a shiny hammer, a couple of those. Flashy hammer. I guess I'll grab like two of these. They are a bit more expensive. Not that money is much an issue in this game, but still. Okay. Let's see. We're fully equipped in everything, right? Oh, no, actually, we are missing a boot slot. Put one of the shiny iron boots there. Okay. Now, uh, yeah, I think there was a fast travel pipe. We seem to go here, I think. It's the one in the museum. And the, yeah, go into the museum. And then that one, I think, is uh, what leads to like, the underground area that has like all the connecting pipes. Okay, well, then, I guess, yeah, we go back here and then ask the, uh, or master or whatever to, uh, lead us back down the river towards the yellow streamer. That's how we got there before. Uh, Sweet Paper Valley, yeah. Cool. Yeah, I guess we haven't gotten to the area exactly where the yellow streamer is, so that's why we can't use the pipe yet. Yeah, I should probably heal. Right. Now then, time to save our folded friend. 
with whatever that thing was. I actually don't still really know what exactly that item was in the box, but you know, we're about to find out. Traveling aboard the Princess Peach with my buds, my Bob Omrads, my friends. My fuse got knocked loose, it flew right off the boat, and so did I. Next thing I know, I'm in the Great Sea. Ah, so that's how you lost your memory. Yeah, I guess I never really noticed. He doesn't really have a fuse. Are you going to blow yourself up? <laughs> to make an impact. It's been a flat. Okay, dude. Stop with the puns. Okay, wow, so he is going to blow himself up. Uh, see, I thought that's what he was going to do initially anyways, but yeah, I guess I didn't... I didn't really... Oh boy, I didn't uh, really notice that he didn't have a fuse. But Wow, yeah, okay, damn. Wow. <laughs> Jesus. That's, um... Hmm. It's kind of dark, but okay. Hi, Olivia. Oh boy. Oh man, Mario looks sad. Wow. Yeah, I'm, uh... <laughs> I mean, I thought that's what he was gonna do when we... Like, when she got stuck here, but... I, didn't, I mean, but then he didn't. And, I mean, yeah, again, I, it's just because I didn't really think, yeah, he didn't have a fuse, but, like... So he did. Oh, hey. So. Giant bee with tears running down its face just buzzed past. A dumb bee. Okay. I mean, yeah. Ah, oh, dude. <laughs> I like Monty Mose, they look cute. What's this guy doing? Are they just having a time? What's up, dude? Did you make the B-girl cry? We mostly don't take kindly to be bullies I... Indirectly, I guess I made her cry, kinda, yeah. I kind of enabled Bobby to do that. Bowser in a while, and he was kind of folded, so I guess that would probably explain his absence, but Okay, I don't think there's anything else we can do here at the moment. Wait, actually Hold on might well, also hold on, what are you doing? Oh. I need to help him out. Oh. Okay. No. It's the thought that counts. 
Yeah, I don't know if I can... I might be able to jump into the little, like, hole that I made back here. Maybe. No. Okay. Well, then we go back this way. There's a door there. There's a door here. You found the cave of breakdancing? It's a bathroom, and I'm dancing for non-bathroom related reasons. Huh. So yeah, these dudes are just kind of like dancing. <laughs> Where's this lead? Oh. Leads up. Ah. I crawled into that rock to take a nap. It was three years ago? Jeez. Alright. Thanks. It's a long nap. You better be well rested. Oh, hey. What do you got? Silver time plus. Yeah, I'll grab that. More time is uh, valuable for sure. Treasure alert makes a sound when a chest or collectible treasure is nearby. Yeah. Not really that worried about that. Okay. What about you? Or you're just like the shopkeep, so I don't really need anything right now. Um, there's another door I didn't check down here. <laughs> Tell me stinks and then I love him. You watch me to touch my toes with one of, or one of these years, I believe. Mandatory team yoga. Dude, I like these guys. The Monty Moles are cool. What you doing, lad? I'm on my break. Well then, allow me to not interrupt you any further. I hope he enjoys his break. Okay, I think that's all the doors down here. So now, we can go this way. Or, well, yeah, this way. Olivia got through here pretty quick. Oh. Guess not. Yeah. I guess I just gotta leave her be for now. Wait. Where'd all the bros go? Where are the moles at? Did they go? Back out here and check. Big M. Wait, Bobby's alive? How? Oh, not quite.
Yeah, I know it. I know it makes her laugh for sure. <laughs> I don't think have we ever. Not that I can remember, but I was gonna say I don't know if I've ever seen like a ghost of a Mario character like talk, other than like booze. But those are just already ghosts. Okay. Hi, Olivia. Yep, I know just the thing. did it. Yeah, I'm as surprised as you are. I'm not I'm not used to something as, like, dark as somebody dying in a Mario game, but, I mean, <laughs> uh, Paper Mario, I guess it can happen. Is he, can I talk to him again, or no? Only ghost I can think of is the toad on the train in Thousand Year Door. Oh, yeah. Kinda, yeah. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I don't know, I'm just, I'm just very surprised that, you know, death in a Mario game, just, just, even if it is Paper Mario, it's still, like, yeah. Oh, there's like a, a like a boot car thing. Toad's automoboot automoboots. Boot car type B output 150 Yoshi's. <laughs> Wait, 150 Yoshi's? Okay. Top speed golden mushroom. So you've agreed to the terms and conditions of our not a lease lease TM. Cool. I got a car. Wait, can I drive it right now? Nice. I mean, this is pretty cool. Can I just run over enemies? Yep. Alright, I like this. Vehicles in my Paper Mario game. I, I also like how it's measured in, like, instead of, like, horsepower, it's Yoshi power. That's good. This is cool, though. This is, yeah, it's a pretty big open area. Scorching sandpaper desert. The sun just doesn't exist. First, though, I kind of want to see if there's anything else down here. No, that wasn't. Okay. The 
cute, but I don't think hitting them does anything, really. So then, no, that doesn't really do anything either. Hmm. All right. Folded dry bones. And folded um. Oh gosh, what are those things called? They're not spinies. Spinies are the, like the, the turtles. I don't remember what they're called. Oh! <laughs> Single hammer swing is all I need, huh? Wait, is that a boo? <gasps> Folded boo. I didn't mean to do that. Scorpion toad. I'm not poisonous. I'm venomous. I, I suppose that's better. But yeah, Folded boo. That's cool. Alright, what are you called? Because I honestly don't remember. Pokey, I think? Actually, yeah, I think it, that's what it's called, right? A pokey? Yeah, pokies. Right, let's just try the shiny hammer. Hmm, I saw their heads though. Well, all but one of them. the terrain. Oh, it's cute. No. Alright, how am I gonna fight a boo though? Do I just jump on it or do I have to hit it with a hammer? I can only line them up in a way that what oh. Mmm, okay. They're gonna turn invisible. Interesting. They look really cute when they're shy. Shiny boots. Uh, oh, no, actually. I only killed one of them, weirdly enough. Spooky slap. Good. But that's going to be interesting that they turn invisible. So you kind of have to remember where they are before you uh, do the lineup.
goes to feed it. I don't know what these shiny spots on the ground are for. I'm really supposed to be here right now, but wait, ice flower. Oh, I hope I can still get it. Fold a ghost. Kind of curious about that. Uh, let's see if shiny boots will get the job done. Uh, for the buzzy beetles, yes. For these dudes, no. Ice flower. That's cool. I didn't. I don't, think, I don't remember there ever being an ice flower in Paper Mario. But the last one I played was Sticker Star, and I never finished it, so I don't know. Hi, ghost. Oh, wait. There's like a cafe door here, I think. Okay, I'm cool with that. what it looks like. Oh, uh, no. It's actually probably not a cafe door. It's probably the, um, the, uh, like, research place for this area. The, with the fax machine. Or fax travel. So it looks like it's a mushroom door. So that's probably what it is. Oh, no. No, it is the cafe. Okay, well, I'm, I'm definitely cool with that. I like these little cafes. Oh. Large boy. Mega tasty coffee. I was expecting the cup to be really big. That Goomba is very small. Mm. Yeah, that's kind of what I was expecting my cup to look like. I like these little cafes. I guess each one is going to have, like, different minions and whatnot. Uh, as the baristas and clientele. Cool. Alright, well, found that. Nice little uh, bonus for coming over here. But I don't think this is where we need to be. If anything, we just probably need to head to the streamer at this point. Try to hit him with a hammer. Alright, dry bones, huh? Probably just try the shiny boots.
But yeah, they will uh, come back. So I no need to not stay around that area for too long. I mean, if this game had XP, that would be a pretty good way to farm it. I guess it's a pretty good way to farm gold if you really need to farm gold, but you don't need to farm gold in this game, so yeah. What is going on with this? I don't know, and I'm just not going to even dwell on it for too long, honestly. significant looking altar over there. Yeah, well, I was going to investigate it anyways, but... Yeah, this definitely seems important. Yeah, I'm going to walk. I don't need to drive all the time, Olivia. bowl of oatmeal I've ever seen. Should try putting something there. And nothing I have is really gonna work, so okay. How do I use the whistle? So just like that then, okay. I don't know if it was just in like my item menu or what. Okay, so can't really do anything there. Grab this. Okay. Now we head to the tower thing. I guess we'll check this out while we're here. Oh, no, I can't. Oh, once again, I don't really have anything for this, so, yeah. I guess I'll have to come back here. Alright, well, we have a couple of points of interest to put in items in, so... Good to know. Head over to where the streamer is. I'm sure all will be revealed once we go over here. to live as a beetle on a cactus, but it turned out to not be that great. Hmm. Interesting dream there. Oh, flashy iron boots. I saw something behind the cactus. Alright, alright. Yeah, I don't know about that, Olivia. You 
You can't read it though, right? Yeah. Alright, guess we're going to like a desert city. Graduate service that I like to call Ask a Cactus. Did you know you can leave a boot car anywhere and it'll come back to you when you use the whistle? Uh, yes, I did. But thanks for the uh, reminder, Mr. Cactus Toad. Huh. Interesting. Sniff it bizarre. Oh, I should just park here. All right. as best as we can. Cool. I got a coin for it, too. Welcome to Sniff City, a desert oasis by and for Sniffits. Sit Sniffy. This is a toad who can translate for us. Oh, that water looks nice. Yeah, I don't think it's working, dude. You're not flying, but you are on a teeter tot, so, you know. Water is so pretty at night, which is 100% of the time now that the sun is gone. Yeah. Fair. Yeah, I'll grab these. The silver upgrades for my uh, guard and health up. Foil. It's, I like that. It's a good detail. Sniff in the bed. Alright, dude. Have fun. I'll leave him to it. Okay, so there's a toad around here somewhere. That's what we're looking for. I cannot, but... Hotel, okay. At least we kind of have an idea of where he is. 
DJ Toad's groovy sound disc. The shop on the right is the best. This is your own brain talking, not an attempt at marketing. Interesting. What's in this door? Not much, but there is a window that can lead to that treasure chest in the next room. Sound discs, as they call them. Instead of vinyls. Ah, yes. A bag of confetti. Very good. Shop, but no one's here, so okay. Well, let's just try and find this toad since he seems to be the man of the hour and who we need if we want to be able to read all this stuff. Shroom City. flower but looked like a weird story of my life. Yeah, that building looks pretty important. And that staircase is broken, so yeah, I guess I know where we're going next. City Royal Hotel. See what it's like on the inside. Oh wow, it's pretty cool. Bro, I'm vibing so hard with this music. Okay, we are really on point with the dialogue in this game. I can't go in the water. What does he have? A key? Yeah, he does. Rude. Okay. What if I just jump over the fence? Yeah. Wrecked. No walls can hold me. Wait, what? Oh! Okay. Mouse time. Lots of mouse. guys were in the game pretty early, so I'm assuming I don't really need to use anything more than just the standard hammer boots. Yeah, that's fine.
Health of all arms. The music is pretty good in this building, though. I have to agree with that snippet. About the whole, you know, vibing process. Alright, can I take that dude's keys now? I mean, it seems like the most important thing. How about the toad? How oh, nice. Plus 10 max HP. What's up, dude? To the front desk. Alright, well, let me help this dude first. You guys get stuck like that. Wait, no. Yeah, we haven't even been to a front desk yet. Never mind. Yeah, I don't know why I was going back there. It's just like the lobby. Although I guess normally the lobby would have the front desk, but nope. I guess this is the lobby. Yeah. Wait, the designated what now? Designated lobby pacer. Okay. Professor's room key. Professor Toad, huh? That sounds like our man. What's over here, though? I'm curious. Oh, just more rooms. Doesn't hurt to check everything, I suppose. Hmm, I'm just going this one, though. dude's having a time. What's up? Oh, it was a surfing dude. Okay. Oh, I'll let him just continue his adventure. <laughs> okay, let me fix your wall up for you. Actual room now. He's on the first floor in one of our 
bas basic rooms, basic. There's a pretty big looking room right there, so I don't know. Maybe the journal. I now make for the sun altar. Okay, well, I guess I know where we're going then. Back to that altar. Well, he wasn't there when we were there, so I don't know. Maybe it was just awkward timing. I do really like this like town, though. <laughs> it's pretty cool. It's got good music. The lighting's nice. Nice sniff it bazaar. Kind of reminds me of um, uh, I think it was called Shy Guy Bazaar. It was a map from Mario Kart 7. So there's a toad up there, and I'm kind of curious how you get to that toad. I don't know. Oh wait, I had a, I have a key. Can I like, can I use that key to like go out these exits now? I wonder. Scorching Sandpeeper Far East. I think that's where I want to go, right? Maybe? No, oh, no, no. These are just new areas that I haven't been to. Okay. So, no, we don't want to go here or the other one yet. We just need to go back to the altar. would have been it. Maybe I should go check the other areas. You can't read this. Yeah, it's, it's fair. So if that's not the stone altar that he's at, maybe there's another one somewhere? I should probably check the uh, the other side uh, gate that I can use my key for. I guess this is also an altar. Can I go over here? Yeah.
Well, the only other altar I've seen is the one that's right over here, but I don't see a toad there. I guess I'll check real quick uh, this area, but this is where I just was from the, the gate, I think. Actually, no. This is also a new area. With paper mache booze. Lots of holes. Journal City is going to the Sun Altar, though, right? So... Hey, let me ch check over here, I guess. spots are for either. But I'm sure they'll be important at some point. Okay, I have no idea where this toad is. The sun altar thing I figured would have been one of the two altars that I had already seen, but he's not out there, so... So, yeah, we are. Well, maybe if it's... Is it not going to stabilize? I didn't check here. The Ouija lamp? said he was going to the altar. Sun instance from the snippet for a fair price. I now make for the sun altar. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's where I figured I would have found him. Oh, the front desk? Yeah, I mean, okay. I didn't think I would have had to, but sure.
sun incense. Well, maybe now that I have that hill up here. The desert help kiosk in town? There's a help kiosk? Where? You? Oh yeah, it is you. Huh. Um, get those towers. out of the dialogue. Okay, well, now it seems like if we go to the Sun Altar, he will be there. I didn't know I was going to have to talk to the receptionist again. I didn't really think to do that. But yes, the Sun Altar. Although, which one is the Sun Altar? Because there's an altar over here, and there's an altar in, like, the, the major desert area. I guess it is the first one, then, because I don't see a toad over there. Still no toad, but at least we have something to use on this altar, so we'll get some progress here. Okay, fine. That might be bad. Oh, well. What? Are we in the tornado? It's wishful thinking, I would say, Olivia. Ah, the mega pokey. Can. I don't know if we should. our hammer with it, so I don't think we need it right now. Oh. Nope. Don't get sucked into the tornadoes, please. Okay, I guess the car would help for avoiding that stuff. Jeez. We can, but... Okay. heal real quick, because, jeez, that hurt. Oh, wait, I can hit him, though. Come on. Nope. 
Okay, let me just heal again, and then I will use the whistle. So I guess we need the car to move around, but then once he falls over is when you get out to attack. Well, I mean, I, I tried to drive away from it, but it kind of takes a while to get to top speed, and they just kind of, like, keep running into me. Right, you're going to spin around, right? Oh, no, you didn't. ahead. Just be able to hit that. Maybe he can stand on the bottom of his head. It has no spikes on it, so probably. And just like start walking, walking towards it. Got him. Pop. Oh, hey. I think that's the man we're looking for. Professor Toad. Captain Tioed. Captain Tioed. So I guess we're going back to the hotel then. So we can decipher those, uh... Uh, like... What about, uh, Hyrulus, kinda? Yeah.
Oh. Okay. Cool. I didn't. Now we know what those are for. Hmm. So. Now we know what the uh, shining spots are for. Cool. I guess most of them are just can probably be items or uh, money, most likely. nice, but I'm not like, you know, super, uh, super interested in like digging up all of them, at least right now. For now, we head back to the hotel. feel this thing uses. Decipher these, shall we? All four toads align their eyes. A shroomy temple shall arise. The desert mushrooms rise, go spark a flame within their eyes. Find six devout and gather all. The fire spirit they will call. The elemental same. The ritual is like a game. The six devout will back this claim. Luigi's here? Why? We gotta find Luigi. Well, I mean, that Luigi lamp might be uh, of importance to us that we saw earlier. Simply guess my sniftly mood. Uh, sure. It's not snickering, perhaps it is strange. Nope. Well, 50-50 here. Let's see if I can get it or not. 
sad. Ah, damn it. Losing costs your freedom. What? The freedom containment chamber. What do you mean? Uh, yeah. Are they all just going to be wrong? And I just have to go into the, the, the freedom containment chamber or whatever? Probably. Yeah, they're all just going to be wrong. Okay. Dude, I don't even want to guess anymore. But I guess for the sake of getting to the freedom containment chamber, I kind of have to. Mario and Luigi. Okay. Wait. What? That's a like game over? I thought I just had to go into the... Okay. Uh, what? How? very confused. Aren't they all just going to be wrong? Maybe I was something I was supposed to do before this. So I could, like, actually win this game, I'm not sure. It's just weird that this gives you a game over. I thought that this would have been maybe what we had to do, but Okay. 
Okay, well, kind of. Get it now, kind of. Only because of Google, though. <laughs> I should have just tried guessing different things in the second round the first time I did it, but I th thought they were all just going to be wrong, because I'm pretty sure all of these are guaranteed to be wrong in the first one. It seems like you have to lose this first round, and then the second round, it's uh, you just have to shoot the snickering one. He's snickering about how he's going to spend your coins. Yeah, because he's like, ha <laughs> Can't wait to spend your coins, so, yeah. Okay, dude. Well, at least we can help Luigi now. I mean, yeah, that's, that's one way to free a genie. Or that is how you free a genie. But I don't think Luigi is a genie just because he got stuck in a lamp. Yeah. What's up, dude? Still not quite what we're looking for, Luigi, but still, it is helpful. Yeehaw! <laughs> oh, Luigi. Sometimes I worry about you, but you know what? You're still helping us, so. You're still being a bro. and mega pipes. My minor in ancient dance would pay off one day. What's over here? Oh, that's a large bed. And a treasure chest. What do we get? Desert tower. need to go. Didn't we find a place to do that out in the Scorching Sandpaper Desert? Uh... Well, I mean, there's all those towers. But... 
don't know if those are where we need to do it. I think we might need to do it at one of the altars. Maybe. I guess let's just sort of see what happens if I go back to one of the altars. There's one just out here, so it's, you know. that one. Yep. The darkness looms, the desert sand and tombs, the temple of shrooms. Okay. Than not here, though. Alright, okay, I guess I'll just go back to the other altar then. If not that, then I guess we just have to start messing with the like towers, but I'm not really sure exactly what we have to do with them yet. Alright, I guess we're messing with the towers now. So, there's one in this area. But I don't think we can... I don't think there's anything we could do with this one yet. My eye would be a feat unless you look around my feet. Okay. All right. Here. And then that's gonna uh, do something. One. Now we need three more. I just gotta figure out where all the other ones are.
because there's there's what four other like desert areas. I think there was one over this way, and there's another one over at the gated area on the left. says beneath the feet of twins entwined in needles there the eye you'll find fire presumably Beneath the feet of twins entwined in needles. Entwined in needles. It's like a haystack or something? gone, Pokey. Well, almost. Dig this. No, didn't do really anything, but alright. Wow, killed his friend. Rude. I mean, I did get actually the good lineup. It's just that there was one missing from these anyways, so yeah. That's why I thought it would it would look kind of weird, but it's because I already killed one. Yeah, I got the perfect lineup, so I didn't even really need to use my shiny hammer there, probably. That's fine. Oh, we got the thing. Now. This one. But with this not being lit, I guess we can't really do anything. up the other towers now as well. I guess I didn't check this either. Right. Uh, 
Was there one? I don't remember if there was a tower over this way. No, there's not. So we just gotta go to the other two, uh, like gates. to the uh, hotel. Well, another one that's unlit. Near walls of waves, a fire's place, and I is there by earth encased. Walls of waves, a fire's place. I assume each of them is just going to be in the areas like that the tower is in as well. So. I think I kind of saw where it might be in this area. I have an idea. Yeah, I think it's probably going to be in here. I thought maybe it would be in here. What does this say? Dig at your own risk. I guess, yeah, we might dig up an enemy, which would be kind of bad. Yeah. Professor Toad spared me from having to do another turn of that.
Not sure. Where in here this jewel is supposed to be. Only my luck, it's probably where my car is. of waves of fires place and I is there by earth encased walls of waves Also, wondering because Olivia keeps talking about the ritual. Maybe I have to do that first before I like do the towers. Because some of them need like the some of them need the like fire. Yeah, no, we, uh, yeah, no, the towers we're not doing yet. We need to do, yeah, this ritual that she's mentioning. I know where we need to go now. I should have remembered it because of, like, the mural, the picture, but yeah, no, I, I know where we need to go. Because we're not going to be able to finish these towers until we have the firepower from the next elemental. Well, we got this one, but I assume... The rest of them are going to need that power. Two of them so far that we've been into do. So we need to fight the Velemental first. Which means... We need to go... To... This. Yes. facing out the different directions, but they might have been facing in either way. It's not too bad to fix it. No, I guess they were facing in, okay. Olivia.
Hmm. All right. What is that? Ah. Birdmouth. Yep, I think it's time for a elemental. Yeah, I kind of figured. <laughs> Why don't you wait here and try not to catch on fire? Yeah, no, we, we got this. Don't worry, Professor. Okay, so I'm bad at remembering, it would seem. I almost got it on the first one. <laughs> okay, well that was just a bad jump. Now the game is just making it, making sure that I just, you know, don't fail. Even though I would have gotten it on that one, it's just that I, I messed up my jump. Okay, except. Oh my god. Yeah, I know, game. I know. I'm dumb. Just let me go across, please. I guess maybe the hurl hammer, but it's only gonna hit one line of them. Oh no, it actually only hit one of them. Hmm. So, another hammer, shiny one. Heal up. 
I think what we're going to do since we have a save block here is we're just going to save and call it here for tonight. And then when we pick this up tomorrow, we'll finish off the Velemental in probably this area. At least I made it, sort of, to the Velemental. So, just going to save. And, yeah, we'll pick this up tomorrow uh, and finish off the desert area and the yellow streamer. So, yeah, I think that will be a plan. But, for now, that is going to do it for Paper Mario. So, hope you all enjoyed. Uh, those of you who came out and watched tonight, thank you very much. Like I said, I'll be back tomorrow. We'll finish up the yellow streamer. And then, uh, yeah, we'll go from there. So, yep, thanks again, everybody. Hope you've had a good start to your week. And I will see you all next time. But until then, though, uh, you all have a good evening.